Well, good afternoon. How are you today? All right, I have a question for you. How big is God? Alright, so when I ask you that question and I say, how big is God, I want you to say, big enough, okay? How big is God? We serve a big, amazing God. You know, our verse in Isaiah chapter 40. But the people who trust in the Lord will become strong again. They will rise up on wings like eagles in the sky. They will run and not need rest. They will walk and not become tired. Amen. Now, how many of you have ever seen an eagle before? Now I've I've seen I've seen eagle before. I've been out on a lake. Male And all of a sudden I saw this big shadow over top of me. And it was as if the sun went behind a cloud huh? like like the sun went behind the cloud you couldn't you couldn't see sun because the, the shadow uh, uh, mm. it was a it was a big eagle uh, you know, sometimes what I've realized in life that we have to realize that we serve a big God that can make a big impact on our lives. So I want to take a look in the Bible today at 1 Kings chapter 18. So let me set the context, set the stage for you as to what is happening in 1 Kings 18. 18, 17 to 18. Um, I'll throw it here. I'll be up through 26. I'll read different passages. Yeah, go ahead. You can read. Do you want to read? I'll read. I'll read. I'll read. I'll read. Okay. Go ahead. So what is happening in the beginning of 1 Kings 18 is that God has called Elijah to go and speak against the king, King Ahab. And see, they were worshipping false gods. And here's what false gods do. False gods promise what only the true God can provide. Now, 
It had not rained in a long, long time where, king, where Elijah was at with King Ahab. Uh, so I'm going to read out of 1 Kings 18, verses 17 through 18. When Ahab saw Elijah, he said to him, Is that you, you troubler of Israel? I have not made trouble for Israel, Elijah replied, but you and your father's family have. You have abandoned the Lord's commands, and you have followed the God of Bail. That are important words that we need to know. Monotheism is belief that there is one God. We believe there is one God. We worship one God. Monotheism is and polytheism is we, there's some out there in our world who worship many false gods. Now, here's something that I see that's happening in our culture. Is we, even though we as Christians believe there is one God, we are sometimes allowing other gods, small gods, small g, to come into our lives. Let me give you an example. These, these false gods of money, fame, fortune, beauty. These are false gods that we don't need to worship. Sometimes we get so consumed with having the right friends because we think that that will make us special. So here's Elijah. He's with this group of people who are worshiping all these different gods. And God tells him to do something. First Kings chapter 18 verses 19 through 21. I'm going to read that for you. Now, this is him getting ready. He says, Now summon the people from all over Israel to meet me on Mount Carmel and bring the 440 prophets of Baal and the 440 prophets of Asher who eat at Jezebel's table. Yes, it is like that. अब तपाईले मलाई कार्मेल डाणामा भेट गर्न इजरायलबाट सारा मानिसहरूलाई बोलाउनुहोस् अनि बालका ती 450 अगमवक्त र आशेरका 400 अगमवक्त जसले इजबेलको टेबलमा बसेर खाने गर्दछन् ती पनि ल्याएर आउनुहोस् 
Jezebel, now just to set the, the stage here a little bit more, Jezebel was a very wicked and evil queen. Jezebel Jezebel So Abram sent word throughout all Israel. So this is the king. He's going throughout all Israel. And assembled the prophets on Mount Carmel. Elijah went before the people and said, How long will you waver between two opinions? See, here's what happens. We get caught up in, should I follow God's opinion wavering this way? Should I follow the world's opinion wavering this way? And we end up going back and forth, back and forth. So here's what Elijah says to his people. If the Lord is God, follow him. But if Baal is God, follow him. But the people said absolutely nothing. See, we have to make a choice. Either we are going to fully follow God or we're going to fully follow the world. Because if we're going to follow God, we can't be worshiping the things that are in the world. If we're going to soar like eagles, we can't be worshiping the things of the world. So we have to make a choice when it comes down to following God and not worshiping the idols of this world. Verse Kings chapter 18 verse 24. Then you call on the name of your God and I will call on the name of the Lord. The God who answers by fire, he is God. Then all the people said, what, what you say is good. Yeah, so this message is so what's happening is Elijah has made a challenge against the people who believe in Baal. He's saying, you are going to pray to your God and ask your God to send fire. And he said, he said, I will pray to the Lord God Almighty and I will ask Him to send fire. 
मो सरोसक्ति मान परमेश्वर राय प्रार्थना करने चु रहूँ वहाँ ले आगो पठाऊँ मनर मो प्रार्थना करने चु मनर एलिया ले वाने and whichever God shows up is the one true real God जब परमेश्वर ले चाहे आफुलाई प्रकट कर उनसा वहाँ चाहे सातो परमेश्वर उन्हों उनसा so first Kings chapter twenty eight verse twenty six now let me say this it hasn't rained in a long, long time. And he tells them to go and gather water and dump it on where they're going to have the sacrifice to their gods. And that water, because they haven't had a lot of rain, is very special. They didn't want to waste that water. They didn't. Uh, they they went and dumped the water where they're having the sacrifice. And the so first Kings chapter 18 verse 26. So they took the bull given them and prepared it. Then they called on the name of Baal from, from morning until noon. O oh Baal, answer us, they shouted. That's it. <laughs> बाल को नाम लिए राती ने उरले बयान देखी मध्यान्ना सम मध्यान्ना समय ऐसो बने रफू कारे हे बाल आमिला जवाब दिनोस तर कई प्रति उतर आए ना but there was no response no one answered and they danced around the altar they had made तर कई प्रति प्रति उतर आए ना अनि आफू उरले बनाए को बेदी को वरी पोरी उन्हीं औरो First Kings 18 verse 27. So the next verse. At noon, Elijah began to taunt them. So he was making fun of those people who were worshiping Baal. He said, shout louder. He said, surely he is a God. Perhaps he is in deep thought. Eliyah le esiri vane, aja zor si takarao, nishit ne, nishja ne, tiyo devta ho, saayat u ghor dhyan ma magna hola. Now, that phrase, deep in thought, that phrase, deep in thought, the words deep in thought, yaan lekhe ko yaan, nishja ne, tiyo ta, in the original language that the Bible was written in, Bible means maybe he's sitting on the toilet. So Elijah was making fun of their God. So he goes on in verse, 1 Kings 18, verses 36 through 37, and I'll read that for you. At the time of sacrifice, the prophet Elijah stepped forward and prayed, O Lord God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, let it be known today that you are God in Israel. Yes, sir. Like that, thirty-six. Look. Bolidan ko belama, Bolidan ko belama. Elia agamba kare, agi bade ra prathna kare. He param Prabhu Abraham Isaac ra Israel ka permission. Israel ma tapai permission unsa ra mochay tapai ko dasu. 
And that I am your servant and have done all these things at your command. So he's asking God to show up in a big, huge way. Let me ask you a question. How big is God? God is, God is big enough to do no matter what we go and ask him for. Let's say amen to that. Amen. So verses 39 and 38. Then the fire of the Lord fell and burnt up the sacrifice. The wood, the stones, the soil. It lapped up the water so the water is gone. When all the people saw this, they fell prostrate and cried, The Lord, He is God. The Lord, He is God. Taba, taba pram prabhu ka ago barshyo, ra ago le balidan daura dhunga haru, ra mato basma paryo, ra khadal ko pani pani sukyo, jaba sabi mani suri yo dekhe, taba tini ru bhuima gopto pari karara bane pram prabhu maha ne parmeshar unu udo raya cha. Now, you may not be worshipping a false god like Baal. But there may be some false gods that you are worshipping. Things that you are putting before God. Instead of making God number one in your life. Those gods that you have in your life, those, those gods that you have in your life, will never fulfill you. Only the God of Isaac and Jacob will fulfill us. If we're going to be sold out for God, sold out, uh, committed. If you want to be committed to God, you have to make him number one in your life. Because all those other gods, are fake. Only God is the true God. Amen. We have to fall down and worship Him with everything that we have. Because how big is God? Let me ask you again, how big is God? We have to remember. False gods promise what only 
a true God can provide. We, it says this in scripture, it says, And I know the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father except through me. It's because of the sacrifice that Jesus made for us that we can have relationship with God. Because God is so big, but He still loves us. There may be days where you feel like God doesn't love you. But that is not the truth. We know that God loves us and cares for us. And how many of you would say that God knows what's best for your life? That's why it is so important for us to put God first in our lives. Says this in Job chapter 19. Says, I know my defender lives, and in the end he will stand on the earth. Even after my skin has been destroyed, in my flesh I will see God. ยันนี้ได้อายุกุปุสตักมาอุนัยสัตย์ได้อุนัยสัตย์ได้กับปัจจิสทบิสมาเกิดเรื่องเกี่ยวกับอะไรซะอุนัยสัตย์ได้กับ
तीन महीना समय मो खात की उठे सकी ना but god was with me the whole time tara parmeshwar mo khat ma huda pani parmeshwar tyo sabai samay ma mo sanga hunu thyo i had doctors tell me that i should quit being a pastor doctor le eso pani bhaneo ki pastor na hau timi aba i looked at the doc sorry i looked at the doctor and i said you're crazy अने वहाँ लेचे डॉक्टर ने अर्रा बनने वाला था तो मैं कुछ दिन खुश किया था क्या वो बनने वाला था I said my God is bigger than any tractor trailer big truck मेरे परमेश्वर तेरे मान उन्होंने से तेरे ट्रक बनना भी नहीं मान and I said my God can heal me अने वहाँ ले बनने वाले कि मेरे परमेश्वर ले मलाई निको पारनो उनसा मलाई मेरे परमेश्वर ने मलाई निको पारना सकनो उनसा एंड इट्स बाय द ग्रेस ऑफ गॉड दैट आई एम हियर टुडे मो यहाँ उन्हों से परमेश्वर को अनुग्रह हो इट्स बिकॉज़ वी डोंट वर्शिप ए स्मॉल गॉड कि ना वने आमितियो फुट्चे देवता अरल को आराधना करते ना तो तीन मान दे ना we worship a big god amen hami che dhere mahan parmeshwar ko aradhna garchau atha dhere thulo parmeshwar lai manchau so no matter what you face how big is god how big is god hamro jivan ma jasto sukai kura har ko sangharsha garnu pare ta pani tyo kura haru bhanda pani hamro parmeshwar chai mahan hunu huncha we need to hold on to the truth and the promise in scripture of who god is you know that go ahead we need to hold to the truth in of scripture amer le satya lai ti pakri rakhnu parcha so when you feel like you're gonna waver amer le satya la pakri rakhnu parcha ra amer le jannu parcha ki parmeshwar ko hunu huncha bhanne kuro ani That's when you say to the devil I know that God is big enough. Ah, ule bhannu khoje kura chhe yero ta. Hamiru jaba hami chhe jaba eta uta eta uta hutye jasto huncha jivan ma athawa hamile sangharsha gariraheko jivan ma hami parchau tes bela chhe hamile le bhannu parcha ke shaitan le leko sabai samasya haru ma hamile bhannu parcha ke hamro parmeshwar chhe maan hununcha es bada tin mala parmeshwar le udhar garna saknu huncha. Can I pray for you today? Let's bow our heads. Father God, we thank you for your love. Father God, we thank you for your grace. We pray that you remind us today of how big of a god you are. Ami prarthna garchu ki Prabhu hamara sadai tapai samjhana dinanus ki tapai mahan hununcha bhanne kura. And God, we ask you to help us. Ani ami prarthna garchu ki Prabhu hami ami mathi anugrah garnus ra hamara sahayata garnus. To not waver. Ani sansar ma Prabhu hami batasi ne hoina athawa hami sangharsha ma pari rakhnu hoina. But be 100% committed to you tara ami prabhu tapai ma samarpit huna saku 100% prabhu tapai ma ami samarpit jivan jiuna saku god help us to show people your love prabhu amela sahayata garnus ke tapai ko prem ami manishala dekhauna saku through our lives hamro jivan dwara because you first loved us kinan tapai parmeshwar amela pahile prem garnu bhayo father god we thank you so much धन्यवाद प्रभु हम तब सब कुरा में धन्यवाद दिशा फर योर पीस तब आनंद को लगी फर योर मर्सी तब शांति आनंद को लगी तब को अनुग्रह को लगी प्रभु हम तब धन्यवाद दिशा एंड फर योर लव फोर अस तब को प्रेम हमी प्रति भाई तब को प्रेम को लगी प्रभु हम तब धन्यवाद दिशा एम एन आम एन एंड आई वन लास्ट क्वेश्चन मेरा अब अंतिम प्रश्न तब हाउ बिग इज गाड रियल लाउड
Thank you guys. Thank you.